guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new, my name is Heather. I'm a homeschooling mom of three kids, elementary and high school age. Today is a vlog day. It is the day after the election. I am so tired because I stupidly stayed up until, I don't know, 2.30, 2.45 watching the news, which was never, it's never a good idea. And I am a political news junkie. I absolutely love news and business news. It's one of the reasons I give the news up every year for Lent. <laughs> um, but today is going to be kind of a reset day, mainly for my office, which is a complete disaster right now. If you watched my November monthly reset video, I talked a little bit about how I could not get my HP printer to connect to my Wi-Fi. <sighs> it was a very frustrating struggle for me. <laughs> So I tried to just set it up with a cord because, you know, you used to be able to just plug the printer into the computer, which you can. However, if it needs to be set up, it needs to be set up on wireless. And so mine will not connect to the wireless. So anyways, it's pretty much a useless piece of junk. So I grabbed an old, old, old printer that I had in the basement uh, that does not, it is a Wi-Fi printer, but it doesn't require Wi-Fi. And I plugged that into my computer. It's actually the one on top there, it's still an HP printer, but um, I don't have instant ink or anything with that. I just got ink cartridges. So I need to get rid of the printer on the bottom because can't do anything with it. It's just in a permanent error state. Anyways, all that to say, I couldn't fit the printer and my computer on this desk over here. So I've moved my computer back to my L desk, but in the process, there's just stuff everywhere and I really need to get it tidied and kind of cleaned out. Um, I also have underneath my feet right here, uh, can you see that? My, the homeschool bins because I move things around in our dining room so they couldn't really fit on top of this bureau that we have in our dining room anymore. Anyways, I don't know what to do with all of this stuff. I have to move some things around and get things organized so that's what today is going to be. The kids are pretty much having a light day. Emma and Jack stayed up watching the news with me last night. We're studying government economics and personal finance for some of their high school courses this year. And so they weren't too young, I guess, when 2020 happened, but they weren't really paying attention in 2020. And so they are obviously now, both of them are in high school. And so they stayed up, Lucy stayed up until 11. So we're pretty much just having a pretty low key day today. Uh, Lucy built a little robot from KiwiCo Clubs. So that was fun this morning and kind of occupied her time. I think I'm going to make French toast for lunch. And uh, yeah, it is 11.15. I just woke up Emma so that she's not in a cycle of staying up super late, waking up super late. I'm exhausted. I've had two cups of coffee. I was still up at 6.15. Why is that? I turn all my alarms off, but my body is just so programmed to wake up early that even when I am up until two o'clock in the morning, I am still awake at six. So there you go. Okay. Not sure how coherent this vlog will be, but uh, the plan is to get the office clean and do a little bit of school and we'll see how it all turns out. Okay, so I'm making some progress. It doesn't look like it because I have my sticker basket here, but I have cleaned off quite a bit of my desk and I've gotten some things reorganized on the shelves down here. I still need to uh, take all of my stuff off of Emma's desk, get some stuff out of the closet, and maybe organize that a little bit and then move all of my books and stuff. I think what I'm going to do is put my planners, uh, my power sheets and my life planner over on this desk and my teacher planner as well. Having some things over here and then maybe putting some, I have some book ends right there. 
taking all of these planners and books and stuff and putting them up on the top of those shelves, I think. I don't think I'm going to move any, hi Lucy. I don't think I'm going to move any shelves in here today because I would have to take some out from the basement and I would need to move all of the stuff that's on the basement shelves to other shelves. And I just don't know if I have enough space down there to do that. I would like to get built-ins. I've talked to my husband about doing some built-ins on this wall right here. And then also on um, one of the walls in my basement, like floor to ceiling bookcases, uh, maybe we can do that. We'll see. It, I think that it would be a lot easier than using, I just have a bunch of these cube shelves down in our homeschool space in the basement, which are not as functional as I would like them to be. They're not as good in this house as they were in my other house. So anyways, it is 1230. Emma is out running. Lucy's going to play outside. It's like, it's 72 degrees on November 6th in Maine. That's crazy. Uh, so it's really beautiful outside. I think that I'm going to maybe make myself another cup of coffee, grab some lunch, and then hopefully get the rest of this stuff moved around and organized. That's the plan anyways. <laughs> So it is, what time is it? Two o'clock and the sky has gotten extremely dark outside. So I am going to take a little bit of a break from cleaning or maybe I will continue cleaning and just turn all the lights on so that you can actually see it. Uh, but I'm feeling good about all of the progress that I've made. I like, like I have the wrong lens on right now. So, uh, the, the books over here, I think on the top of the shelves is going to be good. And I think I'll be able to move some of the books that are down on, uh, on these shelves as well up onto the top, just more my personal books. I think that will actually work out really well. So that's where we're at. I never made myself coffee. I think I need to do that. <laughs> and then we will keep chugging along with this office cleanup. I'm actually feeling really good about how things look in here. Okay guys, it's three o'clock and I am wrapping it up for today. Things are mostly cleaned up. Not entirely, I still have a little bit of stuff that I need to take care of, um, but I like how my desk is over there now. I have my big planner caddy just sitting underneath my desk. I think that what I'm going to have to do <laughs> is go back through my closet again because it's not organized. I cleaned it out, oh, I don't know, several months ago, and now it's a mess again. <laughs> I take things out and then I stick other random crap in there. Anyways, um, I did not really organize these shelves at all and I still have all of my bins, the homeschool bins down there. That also needs to be done but that will not be done until after we are done with our first semester. Uh, it will probably happen, I would say most likely some point in December I will do that stuff like as a project but it is possible that I will wait until after Christmas to do it. Overall, I, I am pleased with how everything looks. I do really want some shelves in here, which I know I mentioned earlier. I still have another drawer that I need to go through for my home management goal. I'd like to get through some more of the homeschool bins as well before the end of the year. Again, I don't know if those things will happen or not, but overall I'm, I'm pleased with how things turned out today. I am so tired. I'm really hoping that we can just go to bed early tonight, that everybody will want to go to bed early. The struggle that I have is that much like this morning when I got up, if I go to bed early, I will wake up early. <laughs> so 
we'll see. It's pretty dark and just gross outside. I don't know if it's going to rain, so that's probably part of why I'm feeling so tired that and staying up till all hours of the night. I'm not made for this anymore. Um, yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this little kind of office cleanup reorganization. I love moving around furniture and stuff, but in this new house, we don't have a lot of opportunity to do that. Everything's pretty defined as far as rooms go. Whereas in our last house, I moved furniture all the time, all the time. I moved bedrooms, I moved living rooms because we had like two living room areas. We had a dining room, kitchen. There were just so many rooms in the old house <laughs> and we didn't necessarily need all of them. So I just moved things around as, as I wanted to. So anyways, thank you again for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and I will see you in the next one. Thanks guys. Bye.